everyone. Today I've got your room movie review. A mother and son are trapped inside this 10 foot by 10 foot room and will their experience turn out well for them in the end. As far as the story goes, this tells this really interesting story that is just full of imagination and courage where the characters are put through all these tough situations because technically in a way it almost feels like a survival story because you never know if you're stuck inside a room and you can't even get out because the door is bolted shut you might go a little bit crazy or uh, just feel this disconnect with society. The mom in this movie has this young son and she sort of tries to tell him all these different stories about how the the world was for her. She's just all the while trying to take care of her son and be as protective of him because there are times in this movie where she does turn into one of those female lions because she will not let even the captor, their captor, touch him at all. Basically, she will do whatever it takes for them to get out of this sticky situation. As far as the casting goes, Brie Larson, who just so happened to recently get a Golden Globe nomination for this movie, and I'm actually really happy for her about that because I have liked her in other previous movies like Short Term 12, and I really think this movie she definitely shines because her role is just a pivotal one where she has to play this very uh, good character and she's this mother who, you know, feels like she needs to do whatever it takes to uh, survive and also be there for her son even though she's always telling him stories about the world that maybe, you know, he obviously wasn't accustomed to because he hasn't even seen what the world is like. And I really think her, the young actor that plays her son, uh, Jacob Tremblay, is also doing a really good job in this movie as well. It's a very emotional performance as well as Brie Larson's, but I think with this child and you see all these little emotions play out and it's all I feel like in the eyes and in the performance, so I think uh, they both end up doing a really great job at um, encompassing their ways to survive, you know, try to be in tune with what is going on with the world because there are some things like even the little boy hasn't even heard of or seen because all he knows is what his mom told him. There are other pretty fantastic performances in this movie by Joan Allen, William H. Macy, and just a whole bunch of other people, so I really think this was a very good ensemble cast. Now the things that I liked about this movie, obviously this story was really engaging to me. I honestly was going into seeing this movie with an open mind, so I didn't really know what I was going to be expecting to see except greatness. Now there were all these imaginative situations. I really felt immersed in uh, the story that the mom was telling her son. And just this whole like, concept of these two being uh, these captives to this one like really horrible guy and what they want is just to be free from him and they have to basically uh, re like introduce themselves uh, into the world even though the mom obviously was around more so than her son. There's just so many like heartfelt moments in this that I like really felt like I wanted to cry watching this movie because it was just so emotional and I really felt for the characters and sometimes like I was put on the edge of my seat because the tension was definitely there uh, in some of the circumstances that went on in this movie and I 
would say that I really loved uh, every minute of this movie. Overall, I would say that Room is probably one of the best movies of the year, and I would highly recommend seeing this movie, and uh, I really hope for the best with this movie come awards season. I think it deserves a real award that it would get. I would give this five hearts on the heart rate scale. So let me know in the comments what you guys thought of Room. And as always, you guys can subscribe to my channel. I've got more movie reviews, movie updates, come back every for a Chill Thursday video. You guys can also like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. And I will see you guys later.